today and I am excited because I'm gonna show you how to make something super super cute. I'm gonna show you how to make little ornaments like this one. Look how cute it is. I hope you can see it well. It's a little transparent ornament and it's got glitter inside. I think it's so cute. They're very easy to make and you only need a few things. A few plastic page protectors. Your hot glue gun without the glue sticks, only the hot glue gun. Glitter, sequins, or anything sparkly that you want to throw into your ornament. Paper cutouts of the shapes that you want your ornaments to be. I chose a fawn, a cute bunny, and a star. I'm going to work on top of these little glass that I have to protect my desk from the heat of the glue gun. And I have my image right here and on top of the image I'm going to place the page protector. And the glue gun is already hot and like I said before it has no glue stick, it's empty. I'm going to try to hold it like a pen and I'm going to start tracing or just going along that border of my image all around it. The heat of the glue gun is going to melt the plastic and fuse both layers of the page protector together so we end up with a little fawn shaped pocket. If you do this, be very, very careful because the hot glue gun gets really hot and if you touch that metallic tip, you will burn your fingers badly. So to begin with, I'm just going to do the tail of my fawn and its legs and I'm gonna stop right there to fill it up with glitter. I'm gonna cut the rest of that page protector just so it's easier to work with. This is a paper funnel that I made so I can pour the glitter inside of my pocket without creating so much mess. I'm going to pour this chunky glitter inside of the bottom part of the foam that I already have and with this stick I'm going to push it inside those smell, smell <laughs> those small spaces like the legs and the tail. Since I have a good amount of glitter on those small spaces that are difficult to reach, I'm going to continue fusing the plastic together. I'm going to ignore that bow and I'm just going to create some kind of neck for my fawn and I'm going to go all the way until the top of the ears, but I'm still going to leave a gap so I can put more glitter inside but this time I'm gonna use fine glitter. I really like how the fine glitter looks because while the chunky glitter falls to the bottom of the shape the fine glitter sticks to the walls of the shape and it makes it look super sparkly really pretty. I'm gonna remove the paper to see how it's looking and mm, I think I could use a little bit more glitter. More glitter is always good. So I'm gonna add again chunky glitter and fine glitter until I'm happy how it's looking and then I can seal it completely. Now I'm gonna cut the excess of plastic very carefully making sure I don't cut through the part that has been melted and that is fused together holding the shape of my beautiful fawn. So just cut it and now I'm gonna decorate it. To decorate my ornaments I'm gonna use ribbons and lace, super tiny flowers, some pearls, bells, paper bows, you can also use gems, maybe even more glitter on the outside, stickers, anything pretty that you want to add to them.
Oh, they are all so pretty. Which one is your favorite? And if you make this, what shape are you going to use? I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.